guys, it's Felicity, and I know I've been gone for a while. I am so sorry about that, but I'm back, and I'm better than ever, and I hope this quality is good. I'm using my Canon T5. Um, let me know if you like it down below. So, as you can tell by today's title, I am going to be teaching you guys how to do a winged dialer. No, I am not the greatest, but hey, I'm going to try. So... Let me stop talking and just do my makeup. Okay. There's a few different ways that you can do eyeliner. So you can use like one of the marker things that looks like you're putting a magic marker on your eye. Um, this one's at like, what is this? I can't see. I just took my glasses off to almost like start the makeup. But this is the Master Graphic by Eye Studio. We're not using this for this video, but I just wanted to throw this in there to say, like, you could use this. And I will do another video. I just have to buy a new one of these because this one, um, it's dried out plus that does, that happens. So we're not going to use that. And then you could also use liquid eyeliner, which is, like, what I usually do. But lately, and this is the flower one. I think it's like Drew Barrymore's collection. I got this at like Walmart. And then you can use gel eyeliner. This is Wet n Wild. Guys, do not sleep on drugstore makeup. Like all these products are basically drugstore. But like please do not sleep on drugstore. Like they are so good. Okay. But other than that, let's get right on to me showing you way and no i am not a perfectionist at this i'm not amazing like yes there are days when i'm like oh shit this looks awful so bear with me let's just hope this turns out good what you want to do i'm using my mirror from my tartlet palette which barely has a dent in it yet but you know and also don't mind my messy eyebrows okay so you want to load your brush up with product and I'm gonna do one eye gel and one eye liquid so I really hope I'm in focus if not sorry so you just wanna basically glide this across your lid lid and like as you get to the end kind of like flick and like, if you're going for a like subtle wing, then you could do that. Like that's kind of what I do. Like yes, and you have to. You want to just kind of point that and connect the rest of it, so you don't look like you just drew a line across your face. Wow, that doesn't look half bad. I am really proud. Um, maybe my eye just knows it's being filmed right now. That's why it's cooperating with me. So, as you can see, you just, so you want to start by doing the line across the lid, and then you're going to want to drag the little brush out. So for liquid, it's more tricky than with gel, because gel, you're kind of in, more in control. With this, this thing has a mind of its own. Um, so, everyone, let's pray have a moment of silence. Usually when I do my eyeliner, I don't talk. So we're gonna try and talk today if I can, but if not, I apologize. So what you wanna do, again, you're gonna start by like drawing against your lash line. Like just ever so slightly. Like don't start it with like this big thick like panda eye because that won't look cute. You have the line all complete on ouch also this one's like really pointy this is the flower brand I already said that but so you kind of just like again with this so you want to make sure you have enough product to do your wing you also don't you're like with the wing it's what you want like if you want a really dramatic wing which I do sometimes 
but since I'm just filming this video, I'm going to just show you like a little wing and go from there. So you're gonna want to like look from your bottom lash line and kind of just like drag it, but connect it to your top. Oh, cool. See, like that happens sometimes and then you wind up looking like a panda. But that's like very easy to take care of and just use a makeup wipe. Okay, so you can start with your little line and then And then you just want to kind of go in and either thicken up the line or just like make it go straighter. Wow, I'm actually really, really proud of myself for this. And then you just kind of want to let that dry. Like don't lift your eye up all the way right away because then that will, if your eyeliner doesn't dry, then it'll make it smudge up which you don't want so I think for now this is really good um, for beginners definitely like like I said I'm not the best at this but I'm trying I do my makeup for fun so if, I hope you liked this video if you didn't I'm sorry um, I'll be doing more makeup on this channel and I'm more moving away from like experience videos and like those type of things because I don't want to be known as a fangirl on YouTube even though that's what I am I want to make a name for myself and not try and do things that other people do as much even though I will be doing like makeup yes a billion people do it but makeup something that I love a lot and I hope you guys understand that I will still be doing occasional vlogs um, I'll be doing rant videos. I will, I want to bring more awareness to mental health. So I will be definitely doing those kind of videos on this channel. Um, anything you guys want to see. So that is all. Also, I changed my Instagram and Twitter names. They will both be linked in the down below if you guys want to follow me there. Um, other than that, that's it. I got new glasses, as you guys saw at the beginning of the video. So, have a good day, have a good night, wherever, whatever time it is where you guys are watching. And love you. Peace. Love.